I welcome all of you on platform of your PD education and uh, you are getting the updates related to various post gate opportunities and uh, you know uh, the kind of forms which you are getting and this video is related to COAP common offer acceptance portal. Uh, let me tell you there are three ways in which you get admission in some institute one is <coughs> you know that is actually reflected on COAP that is majority of uh, IITs are into this now and uh, some other institutes and even public sector NPCIL. So, your result is reflected on COAP, you do not apply on COAP, you apply in different institute but your result is shown on COAP. Second is CCMT for NITs and third is every institute has got its own uh, basically application format and result is reflected there only. So, this COAP may you are to register, if you want to apply in many institutes, IITs and all and you want to see your result, that result will be reflected on COAP. So, you have to register yourself on COAP, so start registering now, the portal is open. So, what is the meaning of this is, you will register on COAP and you will have a number. Then the participating institutes, many institutes, IITs, majority of IITs are participating institutes in COAP. Whenever you apply in those institute participating institutes, they will ask you about COAP number, registration number. You have to enter that registration number. So, you will apply in some IIT for MTech program etc. and it will be reflected on COAP, where you can make your decision whether you want it or you do not want to take it or you want next uh, this thing opportunity. So, the purpose of COAP is like if you are applying in IIT Indore, IIT Ropad, IIT Guwahati, something like that. So, uh, you will get multiple options, no you only want to take one option, not all the options. So, that IIT should know that which student has taken, retained or which student has not taken it, wo sara detail unko pata lag jaye. Iske liye common platform hai, so common offer acceptance portal. So, offer you have to accept, you will get many offers, you have to accept one of the offer and leave others. Others which you leave, somebody else may get it that is the purpose. So, there are many institutes which are participating in it. As of now, we will keep on providing you more details about COAP and different rounds and all. As of now, let me tell you, go and register yourself. So, if you go on COAP portal and uh, you know COAP participating institute is IIT Bombay. So, if you put COAP IIT Bombay, you will get this particular uh, link and uh, then you know COAP ka what is the main purpose of COAP that also you will understand. So, uh, uh, you know COAP is not application portal, you need to be very clear uh, in any institute. You need to separately apply for M MTech and PSUs, you need to separately apply, but your result will be reflected here. So, to access any uh, and make any decision of your choice, you know uh, you need to basically register yourself in COAP. So, if you will not register on COAP, even if you apply in participating institutes, you may not get your result. So, this is completely free and uh, registration number is mandatory for participating institute. So, COAP registration number should be there. So, if you face any problem, uh, you know our, our uh, uh, this mentor is going to, Saurabh sir is going to make entire video how to uh, you know register yourself on COAP. So, uh, these are the criteria as you know, uh, you should have uh, uh, valid gate score 2022, 21, 2020. So, you have not got a valid gate score uh, till that time you know uh, eligibility criteria is that you should have a valid gate score, but it is open now those who have valid gate score can uh, go for it. So, which are the participating institutes IIC Bangalore, IIT Bhilai. So, even IIC Bangalore may result will be reflected, some of the results will be reflected in COAP, some results may not be reflected like MS, PhD normally are not reflected, but uh, some of the MS results are also reflected on COAP, PhD results are not reflected on COAP. Bhuvaneshwar, BHU, Bombay, Delhi, Dharwad, Goa, Guwahati, Hyderabad, Indore, ISM Dhanbad, form is out, Jammu, Jodhpur, Kanpur, Khadagpur, Madras, Mandi, Palakkad, Patna, Rudki, Ropad, Tirupati. So, all these institutes are the basically participating institutes in the COAP round. So, now this portal is open and uh, watch our detailed video how to register yourself on COAP and uh, what is the procedure for that, keep watching that particular video also. But to register yourself on COAP, you should have certain criteria, please follow that and you can register on that. Thank you.